Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how you can use the hyaluronic acid and niacinamide from The Ordinary. Since both of them are water-based serums, there's no right or wrong on which one should go first. Whatever you personally prefer is the one that goes first. For example, if you're suffering from dehydration, use at first the hyaluronic acid and then the niacinamide and vice versa. For me personally, I prefer using the hyaluronic acid at first. But before you're going to apply those skincare products on top of your skin, please make sure that you're always washing your face with your favorite cleanser or your favorite hydrating bar of soap. And then, when it comes to the question, should I apply it on dry on damp skin, there's no difference and there are no benefits if you're going to apply it on damp skin. But if you think about it logically and you have already washed your face, your skin is still a bit damp, so there's no problem. But if you still want to learn more about it, I can also give you a video in the top right corner. So starting off with the hyaluronic acid, which you can also use in the morning and evening. Use one to three drops for the entire face and neck area. For me personally, two drops are just fine. I'm going to use it in my hand. Then gently blend my hands together and use padding motions to apply the product on your face and neck area. Now there's no need to wash it off, you're going to leave it on the skin and let it soak into the skin. Make sure that you're going to give it a bit of time to let it soak into the skin and it also shouldn't feel sticky or a weird film on top of your skin. If this is happening then you probably use too much because your skin can only take up a certain amount of product. Now in this case it doesn't feel sticky, it doesn't feel also weird on my skin so I use the right amount. And now we can also move on to the next step which is applying the niacinamide. So for the niacinamide, again, you can apply this one in the morning and evening. And again, use one to three drops for the entire face and neck area. I'm going to use two drops again. Blend it between my hands. And gently press it into the skin. You will notice that you have used the right amount if you won't experience any issues and you have no problem to apply it on top of the hyaluronic acid. If you now experience flaking, then you probably use too much of the hyaluronic acid or niacinamide. And if you're coming across this uh, problem, I can also link you a video in the top right corner. But again, with the niacinamide, you're going to leave it on top of your skin. Give it a bit of time until it has fully sinked into the skin and it also should feel dry. It shouldn't feel sticky or weird on top of the skin. Now, when it comes to the application, this could also already be it. You don't have to use a moisturizer on top, but of course you can. This also depends on your skin concerns and your skin needs. But if you're going to use the hyaluronic acid and niacinamide in the morning, please also make sure that you're always going to finish it off with a good sunscreen, so that it also can protect your skin from the sun rays. If you're going to use the niacinamide and hyaluronic acid during the evening, and you feel like you want to seal it with something, then you can go ahead and do it with your favorite moisturizer or, for example, the rosehip seed oil. But it also can be any other oil. It just should feel comfortable on your skin. Now this is already the easy and simple tutorial on how you can use the hyaluronic acid and niacinamide from The Ordinary. And I also do hope that you enjoyed this little tutorial and that also could help you out with your issue. If you want to learn more, don't forget also to check out those videos right here. And if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up as well as share it. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you soon in the next one. Bye!